Here's how to change the font style on your iPhone. Now, if you're on your iPhone and you want to use a specific font or something that's a bit fun or different from the default system fonts, I'll walk you through the entire process. But first, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. Thanks, guys. Now, let's first head into your settings and make sure you have the font downloaded and installed that you want. So let's tap on General and then scroll down a little bit until we get to Fonts. And then we'll go to system fonts. Now on here, you'll see a number of different fonts that are already downloaded. And then the ones with the blue down arrow are ones that you can download. For instance, I can tap on this and hit the little down button to download the Andale Mono or Braille. Let's choose a couple of these to download. After you've downloaded these to your device, you can always use those new fonts just by hopping, for instance, say into an email and let's say open up a new email. Now, once you're typing in this specific app or in a variety of different apps as well, what you're going to look for is the AA right here, right above the Q. And then right under bold, you can see default font and I can tap on it and I can switch to any other font that I want to. So it'll give you kind of an idea of what it looks like. Let's just choose, for instance, this chalkboard. And I can start typing just like that. And you'll be able to see exactly what it looks like. It has kind of this chalkboard look to it. And of course, then I can always tap on the AA and switch it back to a default one and basically keep on changing all these fonts, bold, italics, underline, all of that. I have complete control on any of those different fonts on the iPhone. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the like button down below and leave a comment if you still have any questions. Thanks, guys.